What's up, YouTube? Uh, Craig here. RC Beast Mode. As always, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Uh, thank you for all the support from everybody who watches the videos. But this is a little review of my Fortec 2.0, which was brushed. I bought brushed, brand new, with no top, nothing. I don't know how many months ago, but this is it so far. This is the bottom of it. Got stainless steel screw kit on it. Uh, these are the brake calibers inside are the GPM. I order off of GPM Racing online. Off GPM, and uh, it comes from China. It took like three weeks to get here, but these are the calibers that's in here. They're a plus one, so it comes out just a little. Not you, know, you really can't even tell, but uh, those are on there. They're aluminum. These wheels are also aluminum, and they came with the tires. Uh, it came from from China. Again, it took about, let me focus, there you go. Took about three weeks, same as the other ones, three weeks. What? No. Uh, I know. Uh, so these wheels are good. I did get into a little accident and I had to replace one. And, uh,. I dented the whole thing on the other side, the uh, other wheel, it's all messed up, so I replaced that. So all these ones are good, it's all balanced, right? Uh, you do have to glue these on here. They were like 45 bucks for all four. But uh, here's my body. I got this also on eBay. I paid almost 50 bucks for shipping. But it comes clear. I painted it black. See, I ordered one. Another one, and it came, but the box was crushed. So, this is the other one I got in the mail. I did this one black. This is it. So, if it doesn't come with this wing. This wing was ordered from China as well, and uh, they come with different wing mounts. It did. But the wing mounts that came with this broke. These ones are from. Uh, another car I had, but I just made it work. You know, RC's custom, customize it. So this is the wing I got on here. Carbon fiber. Uh, you know, I don't like to put stuff, any decals that's, uh, here we go, look at that license plate, there you go. I don't like to put any decals that's not in my car, so. You see the decals, you know, it's in here. It's a little hood again over there. Get the inside of it. Let you guys get a look. Alright. It does come with buckets. It does. With the buckets that come with it, I didn't put in because I just put the stickers on there. I didn't want all that extra wire. And all that. Plus, I'm going to be using it. You know, I'm getting another top. I think the next top I'm going to do is going to be that blue that I did. If you guys see my videos, the blue I did on my uh, Cadillac car. I might do that for the Lambo top. But, uh, this is going to just be my outside use for now. Came out good, though. It does got a couple of blemishes on it. Those scratches. But, uh, here's my car. Put it down here. So, got the springs on it. Everything's been replaced. This was the brush version I got, brand new. With no top. I think it was like I got it for cheap, like 170 And this is what I've done to it so far. This has different differential gears has different has a hot racing 55 tooth spur 
and you can check my videos on that. Uh, and it has a 34 tooth pinion hot racing, and it then also has a hot racing motor mount, motor plate, motor mount, whatever you want to call it. And this is GPM. Well, this here is GPM. These are the aluminum tracks, cat ultra shot caps. Then I got STRC uh, retainers, whatever they're called. Shock retainers, spring retainers. Got those on there. Uh, as you know, these in the back here, uh, here are Inton G rear bearing carriers. So I got all I got the rear bearing carriers, the rear bearing carriers, the steering into G steering whatever you want to call it and then the C hub. I think it was like 80 bucks for all of them for the whole set. Also has Jim's bearings in it. Also has the upgraded aluminum center drive shaft, which I have to change the steel because see my fan was eating it up, so just don't want to have no stress right there. Because these are thin. Uh the hobby wing in here. <coughs> this runs up to 4S. This is the <coughs> Hobby Wing Max 10, but the 4S one. This is the better one. Oh, let's see. Yeah, this is the 4S one. <coughs> this is the Pro 4S, true 4S. But, uh, we got the hot racing center brace. Got the Traxxas links, whatever you want to call them. Uh, SCRC bell crank, which is phenomenal. Let me see. Let me plug this in real quick. See if I got some juice. Uh, where's my remote? Let's try here. Whoa. This tire is not glued because I said this is the one I replaced. All the other ones are glued, so I can't do nothing. This is only on 2S. This is only on 2S. And this is just a little throttle. You can see. Man, this is gonna be a beast. This again, this is the bell crank. SCRC. See from the side. I can get a better servo. I know I can. A lot of people are gonna tell me on here to get a better servo, a fast one, but I'm not really really turning that much. I'm really going straight. That's all I'm really aiming for. But this will work for now. I might upgrade it. Maybe get a side of the or something. But, uh, I just, this is cut out. This is for my, uh, I don't even know where it's at. For my intercooler. I 
just took it off because I had to, it was bent, so I had to bend the back, so I had to glue, uh, this one's loose, so I had to glue, it. I had to glue this one on down here, this one I still have to glue, but, uh, I will keep you guys updated on all my upgrades, might do a few more, but for now it's pretty good, it's still snowing here in New York. This has just been my winter project. Again, got Jim's, Jim's bearings. Hit Jim up. Tell him I sent you. And he'll give you some candy. I do have the GPM racing drive shafts. The rear drive shafts. But I bent them. With this power that I got in here for some reason, I bent them. not right they didn't feel right in here but uh thanks for everybody for watching as always please like subscribe